Hey there everyone, welcome back to another ICT IGCSE video. We will be continuing our series where we go over the most repeated questions for ICT IGCSE. Now we are on chapter 3, um, so let's start. The first is, what are the difference between a fixed hard disk, a Blu-ray, magnetic tape and memory card? Now if they said that if you want to store a database, okay, so the keyword is a database of books in a school library, that means that now I'm not going to be regularly checking my database and I want to store a large amount of data. So I would use a fixed hard disk. If I want to store photographs in a digital camera, now in a digital camera, I possibly can't put a magnetic tape or a Blu-ray or a fixed hard disk. So I will use memory card. If we want companies distributing HD movies, now you know movies are videos and Blu-rays store the highest quality videos. So over here to be blue. Now once since everything has been chosen except magnetic tape, that will make the last one magnetic tape, but let's just read it once more. Storing the backup of a file server. So you're not going to be checking this data regularly, but you just want it to be there and store a large amount of data. So you use file server. From for hard disk, I mistakenly said it. So what I said for hard disk was what I wanted to say for magnetic tape. For hard disk is when you want to store a large amount of data and you also want to be able to look at the data quickly in case or use that data regularly. That's when you use fixed hard disk. Then you need to know the difference between a pen drive and a CDR. R means read only. So CD read. So let's look at the similarities. Now they are both storage devices. Yes. So they are both storage devices because they store data. They are both portable. That means they can be taken from one place to another easily. Now the difference is that not every computer has a CD drive, but most PCs have a USB port. Pen drive is more robust. Than, uh, pen drive can store more data and a pen drive is solid state where CDR is optical. Now because it's solid state, that means that there are no moving parts, so it can store more data and other advantages of solid state will also apply here. Then we look at advantages of solid state devices to hard disk drive. So advantage is that there are no moving parts and therefore they are more reliable. Moreover, they are very thin as there are no moving parts. They're considerably, considerably lighter. They run much cooler than HDDs, lower power consumption, and they can store more data depending on how you use it. I mean, of course, some HDDs might have more data compared to SSDs, but nowadays, SDD, SSD is preferred over HDD. And that's all for this video. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Till then. Ta -da.